Yuan Bingyan's new work is anxious to attempt. Two outfit dramatizations might be advanced, and the time of falling blossoms is brimming with voices. Yuan Bingyan's new work is anxious to attempt. Two ensemble dramatizations might be advanced, and the time of falling blossoms will be called out in the future. After Yuan Bingyan's organization's tax avoidance was uncovered, her whole profession was truly impacted. Albeit the stage and the show were anxious to give her the shot her birthday, it appeared to be that the pertinent news was erased later. Presently there is a ton of power against tax avoidance related matters and craftsmen. Some of them can't show their appearances by any means, television dramatizations can't be communicated, and some even have their records cleared. Luckily for Yuan Bingyan, the record is still there, so it isn't difficult to communicate later works, however Yuan Bingyan's episode actually impacted her standing. Albeit a few fans actually support her, it appears to be that netizens are extremely intrigued by her rebound that there are numerous disappointment and resistance voices. Full stop. Afterward, Yuan Bingyan's organization likewise let her show her face commonly, as though she was trying things out to perceive how the crowd responded, yet everybody has previously recorded her as a terrible craftsman, saying that the web has consistently had recollections, and that in the event that her television series can communicate out, so others can, correct? Initially, Yuan Bingyan was the second female contender for the Fox Pixie Little Intermediary, yet after this occurrence, the subsequent female number two Shan Aya became Guo Ziyadi. Yuan Bingyan lost the person plan of this possibly unstable work, which was likewise a major catastrophe for her. As a matter of fact, Yuan Bingyan actually has two outfit dramatizations that poor person been communicated, and they appear to be on the Akai stage. One is meeting you again during the falling blossoms, and the other is King Huan and King Chen. As of now, the voice of Yuan Bingyan and Liu Zui in the television series Falling Blossoms is somewhat high, which makes individuals anticipate it. It was recently detailed that Yuan Bingyan's theatrics might be booked to air, however she is only sitting tight for a reasonable time frame. It is said that Yuan Bingyan might return, yet the authority cancellation of her connected data before likewise shows that there is a major issue. She might not have a similar treatment as before when she emerges to film. It is fortunate that the two shows can be communicated, however Yuan Bingyan there is a ton of tension on the telecom foundation of the new dramatization, so I don't have the foggiest idea when it will be. Right when it felt that Yuan Bingyan's works were communicated soon, presently there is news from the media that Luohu and King Changya King Huan will communicate, expressing that in the final part of the year, there might be a transmission. On the off chance that one of these works can be communicated, which one do you anticipate more? Falling Bloom Season Meets You Again This fantasy show has somewhat exclusive requirements. It recounts the narrative of the adoration between the legend and champion for four ages. Comma individuals have changed once more. As a matter of fact, up to one of these two works can be communicated, the other work will be communicated, however it relies upon the time. As of now, different stages are advancing a few dramatizations. For instance, the recently smothered television series Jun Zemang with two male heroes has been broadcasted in a calm way, and numerous different works with double male heroes, for example, Fen Huo Luijin and Pei are likewise anxious to attempt, yet there are such countless dramatizations about Dengue. After these works including delicate subjects are communicated in a steady progression, Falling Bloom season is probably going to be highlighted. Concerning whether Yuan Bingyan's two antiquated outfits will be communicated in the last part of the year, it is at this point unclear, however it is as yet conceivable. All things considered, Yuan Bingyan can likewise show her face on significant stages now, so she isn't totally obstructed. In the event that Falling Blooms and King Changya King Huan can be communicated, which one do you anticipate more? 02. The Chastening War is finished? Wang Hedi and Chang Yifan gave proclamations consistently. Are the assertions useless at this point? These two days, did the specialists examine to make an announcement together? In spite of the fact that everybody's issues are unique, there are such a large number of explanations. Wang Jingyu and Di Liba are supposed to be infatuated and pregnant, yet the two players have stayed quiet. The studios of the two players have progressively given explanations denying the different bits of gossip, yet neither answered the craftsman's relationship status. For netizens, explanation may not really be valid, however not explanation should be valid. What is your take of them? Also, there is the smoking occurrence between Sun Li and Zhang Yi. Zhang Yi's studio at last moved. The past Tropical Storm episodes were all imperceptible, yet Zhang Yi's office at last answered Sun Li's matter. At the point when I originally watched the show Sweltering Mother, the man upheld making an interpretation of the man to play Ming Dao, however he didn't expect that the interpretation sovereign standing would pivot, and Sun Li's ethnicity would consequently be reprimanded. 
Presently the popular assessment is separated into two waves, one is blaming Yeti for not referencing different entertainers in his proclamation. Need to say, a lot to pronounce. Then came Chang Yi and Wang Hedi, who caused the two misfortunes. The justification for the squabble between the fanatics of the two gatherings is by all accounts in light of a cake, Da Fang Da Chandran, the web tales are featuring Wang Hedi and Tian Zui, will it become Chang Yi? The cast has not been formally declared at this point. As a matter of fact, Wang Hedi and Tian Zui have not yet chosen to kick the bucket. This task will just beginning in the last part of the year, and the agreement cycle has not yet been finished. Be that as it may, fans have as of late squabbled, and the show is pausing and watching, taking into account whether to keep on choosing. It's outlandish for fans to squabble, how might Wang Hedi's fans give photographs of the other craftsman P's demise, and a wide range of condemnations? There is likewise a report that Chang Yi's recording of Legends is an unlawful shooting, and there is no record, and the heaps of heaps truly cause individuals to feel terrible. The studios of the different sides gave articulations in a steady progression, which can be viewed as the finish of the squabble. Like Xin Li's venture, quarreling is pointless, as a matter of fact. Their situation and voice in the business can be shaken by fans. Quarreling can ruin the honorable expert, so I encourage everybody to talk as little as could really be expected. Nothing bad can be said about pursuing stars, yet you should maintain the law. To advance your own godlike object and deprecate different craftsmen, not in the least do you not heed the guidance, but rather keep on inciting wars. This sort of conduct that harms others and advantages yourself isn't fitting. As a top-class craftsman, Wang Hedi likewise has the obligation to direct fans to seek after stars reasonably, set a model, and should not wait around, and should retaliate and mediate right away. Any other way, there might a lamentable end. Cheng Yi's ongoing arrangement is to be a combative techniques legend, a costume legend, and afterward act in a few serious dramatizations. Wang Hedi's arrangement is clearly foolhardy. Entertainers ought to comprehend their own proficient examination and make a few unobtrusive commitments to the public film and TV culture industry. Try not to be futile, all things considered, they are well-known people.